Prince William and Prince Harry made a number of secret visits to support injured soldiers as they recovered in hospital, according to a royal biographer. Prince William and Prince Harry, together with their respective wives Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle, are now well known for their charity patronages and fundraising for many diverse causes. The royal brothers both had military careers before they stepped up their duties as senior royals, and supporting the armed forces continues to be a cause close to their hearts. However, in their younger days they both made secret charity visits, according to royal author Katie Nichol. Her 2018 book Harry, Life, Loss and Love delves into the prince's lives behind the scenes. Ems Nichol reveals how, in April 2008, William and Harry made a number of secret visits to Semioke Hospital in Birmingham to spend time with wounded soldiers and their families. Harry also visited Royal Marine Ben McBean at a recovery center in Surrey. McBean told him's nickel, he was very inspiring. He's shown us massive support, and I think over the years people have seen just how much he's done. He puts in the graft and he's changed a lot of people's lives. At this time, the Royal Brothers also helped to jumpstart the Help for Heroes charity campaign, which raises funds for injured servicemen and women. Ems Nickel writes, William and Harry catapulted the charity into a different sphere altogether. When both princes wore the charity wristbands at a football match, it swiftly became a household name. Bryn Perry, founder of Help for Heroes, also told Ems Nickel, Harry, and William led the way, really. They're not a couple of lifeguard officers who don't really know what being a soldier is like. They are very empathetic. They might be princes, but they understand. However, Ems Nickel reports how the princes eschewed the limelight. Once they had done had done their charity work, she says, stepped back into the shadows and returned to their military careers.